everyone welcome to my youtube channel crack that turning problems into solutions this is me priyashna das and today in this video we'll be learning about a complex radar chart or also called as a spider chart now over here we see that in the last data interpretation video we just learned about the basics of how to read a spider chart and convert the spider chart into a table chart that is numbers now in this one along with converting it into the numbers i will also be giving you a question to solve based on ratio so here comes the question compare the style scores of all the three gymnasts to the total score of gymnast one so let's go and find out what are the data or the information mentioned here in this spider chart we see that three different colors are used to represent the scores of three different gymnasts and how is it a bit different from the previous chart in the previous chart we just had these particular dots and there was no complete area inside but here we see a shaded area for all the three gymnasts now the question is will it make a difference will it change the way or the approach of solving the questions not really it's all the same it's just a different representation of the data but the values remain exactly same even if i would have drawn some points and not joined the lines it would have still been the same the score which gymnast 2 has got in execution would still be 9 compared to this data and this line and no matter if i draw this area in blue color or not so this is basically just a different way of representing the same data and i am letting you know this so that it doesn't comes up as a surprise for you in the exam now of course if we check the three data we see that the data is ample three different gymnasts in 1 2 3 4 5 different features yeah a lot of data but converting it into numbers will be quite simple because i see that there is no approximate data in this chart so let's see the diagram and then see the question we have to compare the style scores of all the three gymnasts so that means i will directly shift my graph to the style part and in the style i would be checking out the score of all the three colors that means the score in the red color would represent the score of gymnast 1 in style that seems to me as 10 because the outer line is 10 now when we come to the score of blue color that is gymnast 2 we see it's two points less than gymnast 1 so that makes it 8 and just one point less than gymnast 2 is the green color representing gymnast 3 who has scored a 7 point out of 10 points in style so if i add up 10 plus 8 plus 7 i get 25 that makes me confirmed of the fact that the first part of the ratio that is the antecedent will definitely be 25 now let's go back and check our options which options can we eliminate based on this data so we can eliminate option b and option c because it doesn't have 25 in its first part now the only part left is to find out the total score of gymnast 1 because once we do that and we get to know whether it is 33 or 32 we will get the answer to this question so let's go and figure out what is the total score of gymnast 1 starting from the execution we see that the gymnast one is represented in the red color so the first red color in the execution panel is 1 2 3 so i could say that the score is 3 in execution and in landing it's just one more than execution so we can directly give a 4 if i just follow the red one over here in style it's 10 and if i go and check it out for creativity then for creativity we can see that the score is 10 9 8 7 so the score of creativity is 7 now just a disclaimer for all of you since we are learning the spider chart now we are fully focused on looking at every color and every feature very carefully but once you get this question in the examination you might be in a time crunch or you might be in a hurry it at that time there is a possibility that you can take up the numbers from any other data which can lead to a wrong answer so just giving you a note that while answering these spider chart questions make sure you follow the color and the data very carefully to get the answer correct otherwise the answers to this questions are really simple moving to the last feature which is difficulty so here comes the difficulty score as 8 for the red panel 
So now we have got the scores of all the five different features which we add up and see that it is 3 plus 4, 7, 7 plus 10, which is 17, 17 plus 4 is 24 and 24 plus 8 gives me 32. So that means the score of gymnast 1 in all the five different features would be equals to 32. And if I go back and check my options, 32 is present in option D. And that means the ratio of the style scores of all the three gymnasts to the total score of gymnast 1 will be 25 is to 32. Now, just like this question, you can solve a number of questions related to this spider chart very easily once you convert this radar chart into a tab tabular data or the data which has numbers in the form of table. Once all the numbers are ready in front of you, you can do any sorts of calculations in this particular chart. So if you do find this video informative, please like this video, share it with your friends and of course subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it yet. And I will be up with more such informative videos. I upload videos daily. So do hit that bell icon so that you get notified every day I drop a new video. So until we meet again, please take care and thanks for watching.